So what's it going to be? Will Homeland Security Secretary Alejandro Mayorkas be able to keep his job, or will the Senate find him guilty of high crimes and misdemeanors and then boot him? Well, we may soon find out. On Wednesday, House Speaker Mike Johnson, along with House impeachment managers, will present two articles of impeachment against Secretary Mayorkas to the Senate. Those impeachment articles are related to Mayorkas' handling of the U.S.-Mexico border. The articles accuse Mayorkas of, one, willful and systemic refusal to comply with the law, and two, a breach of public trust. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer is prepared to receive those articles. Schumer said that on Thursday, all senators will be sworn in as jurors in the impeachment trial. But here's the key question. Will Mayorkas' impeachment actually go to trial? It's likely Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer will offer a motion to dismiss or table the impeachment charges. Any motion to dismiss or table the charges will only need a simple majority in the Senate to pass. And right now, Democrats hold that majority, 51 to 49. Republican Indiana Senator Mike Brown joins me. Good evening, sir. What do you think is going to happen? Well, I think that he's going to do everything he can procedurally to not have this come to trial. Greta, this has been litigated in the uh, political world for the last three years. I mean, this was so clear that Biden, with Mayorkas as his uh, implementer, from the day they got there, undid everything Trump had working. Uh, the same legislative platform is there now that was there when Trump, you know, used it. So they've dismantled it. It's turned into the number one issue. Uh, back in Indiana, it is even eclipses the economy in terms of the biggest issue. They don't want it to come to trial because they know it will air out in a formal way what the American public knows already. It's kind of a foregone conclusion in my mind among the American public. That is why Trump is beating Biden in the polls nearly solely on that one issue. Why were they, why are they so stubborn on the immigration issue? I mean, it, it took until just recently for President Biden to think that there might be a problem. And night after night, you know, everyone's showing this video of people coming across the border, whether Republican or Democrat, you can't deny me. You're, you're, what are you gonna do, not believe your, your, your eyes? You have enough video like the uh, uh, immigrants, illegal immigrants taking cops down in New York, barging through the fencing, uh, sanctuary cities now saying enough is enough. All of that has culminated, Greta, in a place that they never imagined they'd be. They would not be entertaining things to kind of, you know, the border bill that was going to uh, kind of take. Uh, immig illegal immigration and codify it at eight to ten times the level in that so-called compromise bill. You know, they do things like that that make no sense and they know that November looms and they're afraid they're going to lose the election based on this one issue and they should because they've orchestrated it from day one. There's no way they can slip out of it. It's for Republicans to articulate it in a way, but we may not actually get the vote. So uh, he'll try to do everything, including well, tabling it. We have motion. We have motions even we can if it's bring tabled, to bear. Though, but in the even, end, but even if it's yeah. if it's table if it's tabled, I assume that the Republicans are going to say, "Well, the Democrats don't want this heard." So I mean, I mean, it, any it'll be a political argument uh, nonetheless. It'll end up that yes. Um, but, uh, I mean, it's stunning to watch, uh, you know, all this video night after night. We'll see what happens, see whether it gets tabled or not. Um, I don't expect that this will get a trial. And if it does get a trial and he does get booted, then we don't have, we don't have a secretary of, you know, of Homeland. And we'll have the assistant and we'll move on to November and see what happens. Senator Mike Braun, thank you. It's, uh, Washington's an interesting place. Yep. Another terrifying story.